Hello everyone, here is a question from exercise 11.1, fifth question, chapter is algebra of class 6. The question is, the teacher distribute 5 pencils per student. Can you tell how many pencils are needed given the number of students? Use S for the number of students. So here they have given the variable S to be used here. And they have also given that the teacher has distributed 5 pencils. And here we have to find out how many pencils are needed if, the, uh, if they have given the number of students. So number of students we don't know. They have to use a variable S here. Using that we have to find out how many pencils need to be distributed. So now suppose let's take an example here. Suppose there's a one student here. Then this student will get a five pencils. If there are two students, they will get five and five, right? And if there are three students, they will get five each. So five, five and five. And let's take suppose there are four students there. Each will get five pencils. It will be a five, five and five and five. And here if you observe this, if there's a one student, it is 5 into 1, right? If there are two students, it is 5 plus 5. Or instead of adding it, we can only multiply 5 with 2. And if there are three students, it is 5 plus 5 plus 5. Again, instead of adding it, we're going to multiply 5 into 3 because we're adding a 5 3 times. So, 5 into 3. Similarly, if there are four students here, we're going to add 5 4 times. Or you can just multiply 5 into 4. So, if you observe here, the 5 is fixed and this number 1, 2, 3 and 4, it's changing, right? So, this 1, 2, 3, 4 is nothing but number of students there. And here also, S, they are asking us to use S as a variable. So, S here indicates the number of students. Suppose there are 10 students, it will be 5 into 10. Now, suppose there are 100 students, it will be 5 into 100, which is 500 pencils are required now. So, that's it. It's very simple. We have to, because this variable, uh, we have to use S there. In this variable place, we're going to put any values. Suppose there are 20, it's 5 into 20. That is. So, let's write down this answer here. They have given to take a S as a variable uh, for the number of students. So, let S be the number of students and pencils given to each student is 5. So, suppose we have to count the total number of pencils here. It will be how many students are there multiplied by, by the number of pencils given to each student which is 5. So, number of students here is S we have taken. So, it is S multiplied by uh, pencils given to each student is 5. So, S into 5 or it can even re rewrite this as 5S. That's it. So I hope this question is clear. In case you have the question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.